Hello Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, welcome. And welcome Cross Watchers. I'm going to be taking a look at what is going on for you guys in your situation with you and the person that is on your mind. Whenever you come across this reading will be the right time for you to see it. <clears throat> but as always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. This reading is meant for the collective. If by the end of this reading you still need some more messages or confirmation, you can always take a look at your other placements. And if you're interested in personal readings, I'll also leave that listed in the description box below for you guys. Okay, Libra. Let's see what's been going on here. There may have been some problems at home that you've been having. Arguments, disagreements, tough conversations, not seeing an eye to eye on certain things. I'm seeing that you could have also met somebody new in your life here. But something about this situation seems off. It seems sketchy. It seems like... You're not getting all of the answers. You're not get, getting everything that you, you had asked. It's like some sort of, I'm seeing some sort of makeup or wanting to make peace. But at the same time, it's like you were left with, some, with no answers. Like somebody avoided the question or gave you just enough to say that they, they gave you an answer, but it wasn't the whole thing. It wasn't all everything that you had in mind here. This could have to do with money. It could have to do with home life here. And I'm seeing it's like you've been, somebody has been spying or somebody has been doing something shady in terms of even money here. I'm seeing like you 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 just want to make peace or you're trying to make some sort of re resolution here in terms of this but I definitely see that it has been tough um a conversation that went the wrong direction it went the wrong way or it was just um I'm seeing sabotage A bunch of information that also left you feeling hurt, Libra. Heartbroken, deeply hurt, sad, um, feeling lost about this. King of Swords. So you have currently detached yourself from this situation. I'm seeing you have um, pulled your emotions away with this King of Swords. You have detached yourself emotionally from this person, place, or thing. You are now looking for truth looking for clarity you could be a little bit harsh or bitter towards someone i'm seeing like you you still have some bitter feelings towards someone because you are yeah holding resentment four of pentacles i feel like there's some sort of something that you're still holding on to because you're still hurt and because it's something that has really affected you what had happened it's like you saw a whole new side to this person if this is somebody who you know you you saw a whole new side to them it's like they showed up brand new um but others of you this is somebody pretty recent in your life but i do feel like you're you're holding on a little bit of a grudge towards them and you're not showing much emotions because they really hurt you. This person really hurt you. And things, things it looks like things kind of ended badly. Or a conversation ended badly. With this Ten of Swords. You were, you're still upset about it. And still holding on to some anger towards this person. For doing that to you. Because you... You have been illuminated. Things have been clear to you. 
it's like is this what you really think is this what you really think of me you know when people start saying things when they're mad i feel like somebody got mad and just took it too far and and you haven't let it go yet it's still bothering you and i'm seeing justice something here it's like you're thinking about whether or not this is something that can be worked on um, with some help. If there's help for this, if this is something that can be fixed or helped. You could be dealing with a Leo. I'm seeing this person... Um, this person... I didn't see it coming with this tower so it, it definitely looks like there's been some sort of sh change upheaval a some a serious situation that this person is trying to gain control over they're trying to gain control o with um with their strength here they're trying to stay strong through this shift because this person's is trying to stay focused on the bright side of things. I see them trying to stay hopeful that there is a chance that things can be rebuilt. Putting back the pieces, wanting to put back the pieces, wanting to fix things, but taking time alone and thinking a lot, doing a lot of thinking, contemplating here, healing, planning. This person is planning on coming forward towards you um, and I'm seeing making healthy choices in love and in life, self-love, self-care, and being happier. So I see them really wondering, or they have a, they, they're hoping that there's a chance to rebuild with new foundations, making healthier choices here. This person may have a little bit of a wild side to them. They feel very, very passionate about you but they really didn't see the way that things were going they this person is in shock that you have detached yourself you have changed they see that you have changed and that you are um not the same as before for some there's there you've taken a break from this person to think, to focus on yourself. This person sees you as focusing on yourself. They know they messed up big time here. And they're trying to hold it together. They're trying to stay strong. I'm seeing healing the star in the next few weeks. And I also am seeing that this person is coming in with an apology here, but you're still having doubts about this person and you're still not sure if you want to even be with them anymore because of how hurt you were. Uh, we have the star, so someone's trying to heal things, someone's trying to make right make right what was broken, fix things, rebuild things, wanting to offer you love. I see an offer coming towards you, an apology. Um, but I feel like you're starting to check out. You're checking out of this situation to the point where you may already have other options, other people involved, a third party, or this it's getting to the point where you're thinking about it. You're thinking about exploring your other options um, because you're gaining your confidence and you know that you know that there's offers for you that you that can work out for you eight of pentacles somebody wants to really work this out here and make an effort someone's trying to prove themselves to you um working really hard to to prove something to prove that they are um they're going to be very persistent this person knows that it's a challenge and it's going to be a challenge to try to um 
being your good graces to say I'm seeing again Leo Aries or Sagittarius that this could be coming from I'm um, I'm feeling like someone wants to prove themselves to you like let me prove let me prove to you somebody wants you wants to prove something to you here I see you cooling off, things cooling down, cooling off after being bitter. Down the line, I just see this person, I just see this person coming back. They will keep coming back. Seven of Pentacles, it looks like they're really going to be begging for you back here, Libra. And um, you're contemplating whether or not you should be in a relationship with or, with them or and be lovers together once again. And um, Queen of Swords, it you it feels like you have checked out. Your emotions have checked out. It's like it's to the point you were hurt to the point where you may have even fallen out of love with this person. I see that your this situation looks like you're still going to be kind of in your head about it, feeling stuck, feeling like you're unable to let it go, unable to move on because of a part of you that at one point did have a lot of love for them and you two were lovers together. But you're looking for clarity. I feel like this person's going to come around and you're not going to see it coming. You're being blindsided here. You're, you have fears. You have fears that they're going to hurt you again. And they really want to prove to you that they, they're not. So let's get some specifics and details for you guys. Is there anything else that we should know here? So this person has learned a lesson, a karmic lesson. I feel like you were put in this person's life in order to teach them something, to teach them a lesson. Um, we have a young male. You or them could be a young, a young male or somebody who's younger. Um, I'm seeing like right now, you could be a courting man or you are somebody who is now single. You are now single um, or separated. You're having doubts about this apology coming from this person. You're having doubts about a reconciliation or coming together. Because I'm feeling like you feel as though you're not free from this person. There's something about this situation that you're trying to get free from. Or you're trying to let go of. I, feel, I don't see you completely committed to them as you once were. So let's get a few more cards before I close off this reading for you guys. Is there anything else that we should know for Libra? So I don't know, you tell me, Libra. Are you willing to give this person another chance? It looks like they're they're literally begging for you for another chance to prove to you that they won't do whatever they did again. But there's a part of you that wants to free yourself from them and free yourself from this situation. You're regaining your confidence. I'm seeing Leo. You have Leo in your chart. Um, or I'm seeing Gemini as well. So confidence. You're regaining your confidence. You, you are. I feel like you know that like you could have uh, somebody else if you wanted to. Communication is key. There's communication coming in. This person wants to maintain communication with you. And they want a new beginning and they want to communicate. You are good enough. Full moon in Virgo. I'm seeing Virgo here. 
Um, so you are starting to realize that you deserve more out of this situation. But there's a new romantic cycle that begins for you, a new beginning in Libra. So I do see a relationship for you guys in your outcome. But it's going to take a while, and maybe seven months down with that Seven of Pentacles. When the timing is right, Seven of Pentacles is my divine timing card. So I see a new romantic cycle for you beginning uh, a relationship, engagement, marriage. With that being said, this is what I'm seeing for you. If it resonated, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Bye.